Welcome to CAP's interview with Claudie Grant, Jr., Human Resources Specialist, Defense Commissary Agency. I was born uh, with glaucoma. I'm a lifelong glaucoma patient, and of course it affected both my eyes, and I had a great deal of difficulty uh, landing a job. I can remember going to numbers of places and I was told that um, you are a well-educated man, however you have a disability. But I never gave up. Uh, I kept trying. And so I finally got a job at Department of Health, Education, and Welfare. And I was uh, grateful for that job. And uh, I enjoy the work that I'm presently doing in uh, recruiting individuals with targeted or most uh, severe disabilities uh, to work for the uh, Defense Commissary Agency. Um, I'm, I'm delighted uh, to have the opportunity to work with uh, uh, the wounded warrior issue. And so what I am doing now is working along with my supervisor and the Director of Human Resources to not only uh, hire wounded warriors but to accommodate them. CAP has provided me with a large screen reader, uh, closed circuit television, of which I use often to enlarge print uh, so that I can see it and it gives me some sense of independence. CAP has also provided me some training um, with computer as well. Having the services that have been provided to me by CAP has afforded me the opportunity to work, uh, to work with some comfort and with independence. I've always believed that people with disabilities can do the job if properly accommodated. They want to do a superb job. In my years of working in the government and working with people with disabilities, I have seen uh, people who are shining stars. They have gone above and beyond uh, the call of duty in order to be successful. And they have made major contributions to this government. They've made major contributions uh, to this organization. And people with disabilities uh, also are valuable, they are productive, and they are always willing to work and deeply appreciative of their jobs. To learn more about how assistive technology helps people succeed in the workplace, visit www.cap.mil.